three things you should think about when dealing with genetic data is transparency, consent, and control. Um, so making sure that the user has complete control over when they are sharing data and wh with whom they want to share data, uh, that they can opt in to research with informed consents and other types of mechanisms uh, that allow them to participate in sharing, as well as um, having detailed transparency mechanisms like privacy policies that are not just those lengthy privacy policies but that are um, high-level summaries in language the consumer can understand so that they understand what they are um, opting into when they decide to do the testing. Uh, the current way privacy policies are written with legal language um, is important but we should also be sure the consumer can understand that legal language. So I think that the work that we do um, is very similar to RRI here in the EU. Um, we bring together these stakeholders to discuss ethical challenges and new technologies and think that bringing responsible practices to the industry is going to be core to the success of the industry. Um, there are there are ways that RI is done and these toolkits can help us to implement those more comprehensive dialogues that you guys are having over here. Uh, RI is not a concept that the US readily adopts, but I think it should be. And the toolkits and the roadmaps can be helpful in getting US companies involved in RI.